and welcome to the Blind Monk Society. I couldn't help but notice you've had your eyes pecked out by ravenous birds. Foaming at the nostrils. Yes, foaming at the nostrils indeed. But fear not, brother. We shall help you learn to see again with your ears. We shall start you off here with a simple test. Brother Humperdinck. Yes, master. Would you be so kind as to stand over in that corner there and sing Mary Had a Little Lamb until this fine young gentleman finds you? Yeah, whatever. Mary Had a Little Lamb, E-I-E-I-O. And everywhere that Mary went, Danny DeVito was sure to go. Uh, Brother Humperdinck, I don't believe Danny DeVito was in this song originally. It's the name of a sheep. Ah, what do you know? Anyway... Danny DeVito pulls out his gun and shoots little Bo Peep. That's quite enough, Brother Humperdinck. Just whistle until our lost little friend finds you again. Whoa, back off, buddy. I ain't your girlfriend. I may be sexier than a bear in britches, but I don't swing that way. Fantabulous. You did a wonderful job. Now, if you would be so kind as to follow me outside, we can get you to your next challenge. Um, brother, I, I do believe I asked you to... Come join me over here so we could mosey on over to your next challenge. So if you could come hither, that that would be admirable of you. And, uh, ah, very good. Now, our first challenge has to do with water. You see, there's a river just over here. And it flows down from a lovely cool little pond. And there's a waterfall around the other side, which is very refreshing. Well, uh, brother, I, I seem uh, to have noticed that you've fallen behind uh, again. Yeah. Uh, this is becoming a nasty habit you have, but now, what you'll do is you can follow the river down to the lake shore, and then you can follow the lake shore around until you've come upon, uh, come to a dock, upon which is placed a wind chime, which makes a lovely plinky tinky sound. And, uh, we will want you to bring this wind chime back to us so that we may enjoy it for ourselves inside the monastery. Lagging behind a bit again, are we? Well, let's... It's beginning to become a prop. Anywho, once you have found said wind chime, Igor here will be up in the bell tower ringing the bells so that you may be able to find your way back. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet, Igor. He hasn't even left. Sorry, <laughs> man. Well, uh, brother, I, I seem uh, to have noticed that you've fallen behind uh, again. Yeah. Uh, this is right. So. Here we are, as you can hear, there's the river behind me. Uh, so if you just follow the sound of the water and keep it on your left, you'll head east up towards the lake. Uh, upon which, when you reach it, you can keep the sound of the lake shore lapping at your left. And follow that around until you come to the dock, uh, which you will find the wind chimes. Uh, so good luck, we're, we're all counting on you. We will all be singing hymns at the front door of the monastery when you return.
Hey, what are you doing over there? You stealing my wind chimes? Why are you monks always stealing my wind chimes? You people are crazy. I'll get my shotgun and shoot you. Come back here. Again. I need nutrients, sweet, delicious nutrients to put in my mouth. The grass is making my feet wet. My feet and my bum are wet. I'm hungry. Where am I? I'm tired. Where's a place to sit? I don't want to sit in the grass. It's all wet. I don't want to wet. I've been standing here for years. I'm so busy. So you better get out of here and do some sitting. Like grass. Joining in and talking Anyone nonstop. There? All the monks here need to talk constantly to know where we all are, otherwise we'd be bumping into each other or getting one person confused with another. If you want to have a conversation with any of us, you're out of luck. We like the sound of our own voices so much, we won't even let you get a word in. We're just going to stay here. Brother, over here! Welcome back! Oh, this is a wonderful wind chime! Thank you for bringing it to us, I hope it wasn't too much trouble. What's that you say about a pirate? Oh, you are a silly lad. Anywho, uh, we will take this wind chime and place it inside the monastery, and in the meantime, you can get on to your next challenge. You see, there's another wind chime that is hidden deep within the forest, and the only way to find it is by following a clever little woodpecker who flies from tree to tree making a rat-a-tat-tat sound on each one of them. And to guide you to the woodpecker is our good friend, Brother Humperdinck, who is going to be standing in the forest and will yell to you. Brother Humperdinck, we're ready! Yo, the woodpecker's over here. Kindly just walk this way. I can show you where the woodpecker is. But you're not coming over here. You're just making me more angry as time goes on. This one, come over here so I don't have to do anything to you. Come on, woodpeckers over here, would you please just come over here, I'm getting really sick of this. God, why does, finally, you finally got here. Woodpeckers over there, now go get them. God, freaking.
Yeah, why are you still in my wind chimes? I'm a lonely lumberjack, and they're my only source of companionship in this entire woods. Why are you gotta steal my wind chimes? Hey, where are you going? If you don't come back here, I'll cut you down with my chainsaw. Why are you bastard? Ah, brother, you're back again! So quick too, you must really be learning how to see with your ears. And you brought the wind chime. That's fantastic! What's that? Almost murdered by a stereotypical Italian lumberjack. Oh, you sure are quite the joker. Anywho, let us rejoice with a festive jig. Brother Humperdinck, would you be so kind as to play us a song? This is the last time I'm doing you any favors, you happy bastard. Excellent! Let us jig! <laughs> <laughs> 